like pretty solid extra money, but it also runs the rest of them like getting into it. Biofoam stuff would be good. I think I wanted sterile materials because that would do rooms. I was originally headed for prosthetics because my people had injuries and stuff, but I don't need that right now. I don't really ever find a need for auto doors because power outages happen. Like I said, fire foams are good, but I don't have that much steel. Um, I can't go that way for some reason. I guess I have to do stuff before it. Let's see, smoke crop packs, mortars aren't really a thing. What is this? Ah, oh, that's just heavier stuff. Biofuel and stuff like that isn't useful yet. Mm -hmm. Sterile materials could be, but I just don't have that much money or steel available for it. Mind you, by the time they'd actually research it, it wouldn't take that long. Up at Devil Strand. Devil Strand would be good money. I would need to put another set of growing areas, which I could put up the top, honestly, if I wanted to. Let's see. Be sewing, it's not really important. I used to grow um, chocolate trees, but I don't need it to specifically grow any of these. Like, they'll grow up, but they're not going to cut it. Drug production or psycho brewing. Makes it tea. I don't really need the armors. Um. What are these IEDs? IEDs are useful though for those goddamn um, thingies. Whatchamacallits. Hmm. Maybe we go for packaged survival meals. That seems like something practical for now. Yeah, it, it is. Welcome in, by the way. Um, I have a trader. Yeah, I've got... I am assuming, I haven't counted recently, but I'm thinking I've got 40 and I've got 16 prisoners and I just got one before. I'm just waiting for him to finish talking to him to move the rooms because I need them to move out of there. But I generally had really big bases in the past, so... I um I want to get back up to had I think 175 or something before. And I kind of want to get back to something huge like that. Uh, you can definitely go and call them. I have been waiting for a trader to come overhead for so long, and I finally got one coming overhead finally. So I think I've got it. There we go. Play. All right. So you have to have finished talking to somebody by now. Come on. Okay. Great. Look, can you just, is there no availability in other rooms? They're all in good health. I just don't want three in one room. I wanted to put one over here. I'm going to have to turn this back to being prisoners' beds. But I don't like this. I don't like that three are in one room. Surely you guys must be recruitable. Mo almost is, actually. I might try... I might have a quick look around and just take a squiz and see if anybody's inspired. Taming. Frenzy. Frenzy. I bet one of these guys over here has inspired recruitment or some shit. Okay, we're going to try to get Mo next time we can talk to them. Oh yeah, the thing overhead. Sweet. So, I have so many animals and this person is interested in animals. Like, this is exactly what I'm going for. I'm going straight down to the bottom of my list. You can take any kind of other bed. I will take that shock lance. Let's see. Black jacket, you can take it. I have some good talks. We are going to come into winter soon, but I know that they can make more. Not the excellent ones. Normal. That's a Marflo. Uh, excellent. Normal. Good's fine. Good 92%. They're not going to probably pick that back up unless somebody's desperate. Plain little pants. Let's get rid of normal. If I get rid of the normal ones, there's a chance that they're going to make them again. If they make them again and they're better, or in any way a lot better, 
it'd be really good. I'll get rid of these. I know they've got like excellent and stuff like that, but they won't put it back on. I have got a liver. I've got training things, which I need to use. Uh, they have like two grand as well. So let's see. I could buy these for the animals. I'll see what I can trade. I've got a lot of animals. You got more steel. That's an easy trade. Don't need drugs. I'll take your medicine. You can take... Oh, I forgot I've got all the furs at home right now. See, I'll keep the wools because I've got winter coming. Get rid of the fur, fur, fur. Wool skin fur. I need blue fur. I need to keep that. Actually, I'll buy some. Holy shit. All those beds are going to get made in an instant. Let's see, get rid of these. I'll take your cloth. I'm still making shit with cloth. Take your components. I don't need that stuff. Um, I will keep my eggs. I will keep my food. It's like eight grand behind, but I have a lot of animals that can go. I could either slaughter them and get good meat, or I could try to sell them. I don't have any available to go there. Honestly, I'm just going to cop off cotton? Cloth. Screw that off. I don't need that much. Let's see. Animals. So I wanted to get rid of my alpacas. I know they're pregnant. I'm going to have to wait for them. I'll get rid of the male. All right. I am getting rid of animals for winter, and I've got a whole bunch that are pregnant. There's a good chance that the group that's still out are going to have a wide variety of animals. Not getting rid of my dromedaries. You can take some of my cows. A, bull. a few of these are pregnant, so they'll probably have a male at some point. Let's see, I've got a lot of sheeps. Some are pregnant. I'll keep the pregnant ones. Mm. I don't know if I have another male somewhere in here, maybe, but I don't know. Let's see, little pig. It's females. Got a goat. I like the fact that some of these are pregnant at the moment, so it makes it a lot easier for me. I've got three males, so I can get rid of two of those. Have another female. Let's see, time to cull some of my guinea pig population. My guinea pig population is pretty out there, honestly. Get rid of that. Alpaca. Calf. I'm not even reversing the debt yet. I do have a little male calf. Alright. Now, I think... My quantity of male adult turkeys is what's keeping everything so fertile. I don't want to get rid of too many of my cats. My people will cull their own cat population. Um, let's see. I have a lot of lambs. That's true. Piglets. Baby goats and stuff. I've already sorted out the adults, so I don't really mind. Cat five. Let's see. Guinea pigs. Yep. I'm starting to almost break even. See, there's a male duck. You guys don't get pregnant, so I can't just, like, flip you out. The roosters, though, I should have some little ones. I am keeping most of my chickens. That is a thing. I have a lot of female turkeys. I'll get rid of some of the ones up this end. Uh, let's see. Turkey male, you're five years old. You'll be right to go. Nine-year-old one. Rid of some of the chicks. They're not much, but they're whatever. And I'll get rid of you guys. We're almost breaking even. If I didn't want so much blue fur, it would be pretty much even. So let's see. Components. I'm selling basically all my furs, buying some blue fur. Um, I could make this a little bit better by throwing down that and that. Now we're breaking even. I'm not losing money now. Getting a heap of steel. And I'm getting some leaves for the animals, which I'm pretty sure I don't allow inside my building. Actually, fuck it. Let's see what happens if I do this. Yeah, all right. Let's do that. All the monies. Whoa. Stuff's happening. Okay, so I'm now refusing and fighting. Cool. So, what are you guys like? Honey, pyromaniac. Greedy, that's some good melee. Body modder, bloodlusts, oppressive. You can die, rocks can die. Um, 
Maybe you too, because that's a lot of negative. Okay, so we want purple, uh, Sierra, and what is your name? I'm just going to call you Iro. It's like Iro and Cerno or something. That's not a bad name. I'm going to say, I want these three. Should be able to take them out. Now, the question is, where am I going to house them? Probably here. Kind of a good spot. Do I? I do have wood on these people, right? Or did I sell it all at the last place? I'm pretty sure I sold it. Okay, dokie. Well, let's see. Can you find a couple of people that can cut some trees down? Leave you here. Actually, I'll just set a couple of trees to be cut right here. And I'll just get you guys on that while I'm doing this battle. Where is Red? Bren? Was it Bren? No, Red. You. Tree. Bren, what is your social? Plants is too low. Uh, not high enough. Plants. You can be cutting a tree down. Ooh. Lumi has a lot. Enyo. And do plants. Probably a dozen or so trees should be enough. Get you guys out of there. Oh, the rest of you lot are about to get attacked. Let's move up a bit. I could also use that space there, but over here is going to be easier because if I'm going to take three people, I only need to smack down a door. And I'm pretty sure they're about to drop some. But not rocks and not this one. So, you guys, you're almost in the area. If I bring it up about here. Almost. Just a little more. There we go. Okie dokie. A few people here that have got it. You can shock that one. Who has the other one? You. You can shock that one. Okay. Three on the individual and that should be... Boom. Okay. Now... You lot. Well, apart from the people cutting the trees, just ignore those. You can attack that one. And or the top half of you lot can attack that one. I don't want either of them. Okay, trees down. Bren, really? What kind of a fucking shot was that? She was a one shot for God's sake. I don't even think I saved it. Holy shit, wait a minute. That was ages ago. I'm not even going to be in this fight. I don't even know if I saved after doing the, um, oh, I didn't get a chance to. Oh my God. Oh, Bren, why'd you die? It's so far back. It would have been before the trade and stuff. So there'll be no galactic trade, which means no extra steel and all that sort of stuff. This is back here. Um, Mo was pretty close to being recruited. I'm pretty sure Corpsey was talking to him, so I'll change that over. And I need to change this over. Let's save that. I was getting rid of so many animals too. It was going to be magnificent. What a trade that was going to be. It was going to make light of this area. It really was. Uh, wait, is it the same? Holy shit. Bucky. Oh my god. Hold on. I don't think I can save like this. Alright. Well, this is frustrating that I have to do it again, but it's so lucky that I got the same trader. Sometimes when they re-roll this, they don't give you the same. I could take that for the steel, honestly. I could take in so many things for steel. Okay. Now I've got to go through and figure out what I sold again. Like some of it's going to be easy. And some of it not so much. Normal. These are all normal. Yeah, okay, and I'm pretty sure I sold all these regardless of this stat. I wasn't getting that. I was getting this steel. Still got the same amount of steel, so it's kind of good. I think I got medicine. And I sold some wools. Basically everything except for blue fur, which I bought. And not buying cloth. Buying components. Honestly, I have so much food for them I could have sold. Alright, now here's the difficult part is working out the fucking animals again. 
So I want to get rid of the alpacas. Let's see. Yaks. I'm pretty sure my yaks are out and about at the moment. I don't get rid of dromedaries. Easy thing is some of these are just like, yes, if they're not pregnant, sell them. But at the same time, I said, I don't know how many males I've got. And a lot of the ones that aren't pregnant are usually necessarily males. There's a male goat. I don't want to get rid of that. Another male pig. I had one before, yeah? For that. More male pigs. Guinea pig. Uh, I'm hoping that they give birth to some male guinea pigs, actually, because I'm getting rid of a lot of them. Half like calf, cow situation, turkeys. I think I kept one male. I wasn't getting rid of the females because they can't necessarily breed them away. I actually think I accidentally sold Zeke last time because I wasn't paying attention. I feel like I did that. I would have been so mad later. Would have been fucking beyond mad if I had have seen that later. Let's see, the sheep. All the piglets and stuff and the baby goats. Um, let's see. I normally keep up to like normally like cat three to five and stuff like that. I don't like when they put in like cat four and stuff like that and cat two is like a stack. It's like, well, how am I supposed to know which ones I'm fucking selling? Let's see. More guinea pigs. I actually have like ducks and stuff for sale. Don't hit that. See, the ducks can stay, the hens can stay. I've got a couple of roosters. Let's see. I won't get rid of the turkey. I'll get rid of the chickens. I am definitely over. I don't think I'm the same kind of over, but I'm close enough. Close enough, I think. I actually just keep the female chickens. They become adults. I don't know if they'll stay or if they get culled. Let's do that. That's immediately like the majority of this gone. Fucking save it. Let's let's double save this. Let's not make that mistake again. I really hate it when it like rolls into an attack. That should have like a good population of this gone. And I want to see up here. Come on, let me click on it. There we go. Whenever there's something in the way, I can't always click on it. What I want to do is have 10 female. All right, so those will come up to being like still keep them. I was going to say, I'm like, I must be getting close with some of these egg laying ones. Yeah. What I should just do is allow like any amount of like the youth. So when they get up to like adulthood and stuff, for, like the males and stuff, they'll get cold. And same with like the little. I think the egg laying ones are okay for that. Panthers and stuff like that is kind of like no. Just kind of keep that. Um, let's see, they keep five. That's the same thing. I just want to check this. I haven't really got stats on it. Adult male one. And I guess I have like five female pigs. Probably. I don't know. I think one with the fact that they're usually like on some level of pregnant should be fine. Keep at least one male spare at all times. Oh, fuck it. Just allow the numbers. I'll let them cull when they become adults. Should be fine. The deer. I have got deer now, I think. Two adults, two adults, any number of things. I'll allow that with the cows as well, actually. I'll just let them grow them. The cats and panthers get out of control and eat all the meat, so I can't. The ibexes, I've only got like one and one, honestly, here. Let them... Let them get up till about five females, two males, not two. I generally have like a general rule of like two, two for like males in most cases so that in case one gets hunted and dies. But yeah, I think they should mostly be fine. Them, let them grow, let them breed. I've got 10 alpacas, I really only want like five. The yaks are fine, the horses can be fine, thrombos are fine. Dromedaries are just infinite. 
let them just breed like flies. And what else have I got? I do get donkeys occasionally. I don't really need many of them. Mufflows don't cull their offspring. They'll do it. Cool. Bring that up to date a bit. We got females. Yes. Call the male. I get another rhino. Yeah, you can treat. Uh, you can um, what do you call it? You can train that rhino. That'd be fine. And I'll save that. And I'm gonna save it twice because fucking hell, I'm not redoing that. Cool. Now that group weren't also being attacked, so that's also good. They should keep going on their way home. It's going to be a while before it restocks. These ones up here. Yeah, they're still 15 days away. It's basically a season away from it. I haven't had any quests for a while. Oh, uh, actually I have. I just didn't notice. This must have been what came up earlier. Human leather. Yeah, no. I don't give a shit what they're offering for that. I don't take it. I, unless I can buy it, they're just going to get really stroppy about it. When all my animals get back, I'll cull them properly. How's this going? It's two degrees. Outside should be getting colder too. Throw that down a little bit cooler. I do have plans to have a second cooling unit on this. Maybe here? There. That'll do it. I'll make that later. How's the wildlife going? Uh, get rid of the rat. I've almost built these. I have got still a good amount of steel. Like my other group's not home yet. But they're still doing pretty good. I'm waiting for them to like replant this area. I was hoping one of my colonists needs to rescue. I'm gonna undo that spot. Where is it? you uh oh your eye was cut out jesus i don't think i've got any bionic eyes but i also do have skill trainers in here somewhere there's one cooking all right who out of the new people somebody's got the flu all right who would like to learn cooking who's passionate um you guys were the newest ones. I'll probably have to wait until the next group come out before I can find out. I do want to give the new group coming through, getting um, socialized and stuff like that, a chance to potentially like have passions and stuff increase. You do have animals. You could be worth it. You've got a 10. Let's grab you on animals. And I want to see, I don't remember what your name was. I had it a moment ago. Uh, it's Trotto. You. Okay, so animals, ooh, 10. Shit, that's high. Yeah, all right. That's gone up as a priority. You can go down to two. That can be what, three. Yeah, all right. That should be fine. You can do all the animals. I'm... As I get more and more people, I'm not going to have every single person doing cleaning and hauling. Like, it's going to be, like, some may have one or the other, or some may not have as much if they're responsible in other kind of areas, you know? So who has the flu? Gat does. It's fine. There's a sword here. I should also just quickly check everybody's got a weapon. Um, where's my buttons? It's this. I can jump around the screen a little bit. You don't. You do shooting. Uh, that's bi-coded. Uh, you're not that great to have a masterwork. That's bi-coded. Bi-coded. Auto pistol. That'll do it. Okay, who's next? Yeah, there's a fast way to go around the map like this. And it's not too bad. The only problem is that does jump around quite a lot. Uh, there's a couple of masterworks made. I usually don't choose this option unless I am trying to find stuff quickly. And I don't want you to have that. Maybe a sword? Uh, we're almost there. 
You're a pacifist. Mm, you don't have something. You're talking to people, though. I'll wait a moment. Where am I going? Uh, over here. I'll just wait until she's done, and then I'll grab her, like, a melee weapon or something. She can have this. Consuming milk. You can do that instead. Okay. And Shizuka is a pacifist, so that's fine. Everybody that's at the base currently has a weapon. What'd you make? You made a pigskin pants. And you made a bed. You made an animal fur bed. All these beds should start getting made now that I got all that cloth. I don't expect all of them to get made, but I do expect a good amount to be made. There's quite a lot. I think there's enough that if I was to go, say, sleep. Okay. So now all of my animals, all of my, like, pets should end up hopefully chilling out back up in, like, the good beds up top. I'll just put all these back in here. And take a little bit. I'm glad though that they've been putting all this food down for the animals because whether it's here now or whether it's here in the future, it's gonna freeze soon for winter and they're just gonna have all that food already, you know? And if they keep actually like growing shit, then I'll end up having so much food for both the people and the animals like the big thing is like dealing with the amount of animals feeding them and stuff because every time they tame they take food to tame them so it requires a fair bit okie dokie so I want probably this section up here to be all that the rest of it I think that amount be fine for winter my people arrive back here that's fantastic I'll have so much to deal soon and I'm getting three people breaking, just these three. Cool. I can manage that. They don't kill themselves first. Let's see. Let's bring a raid up. Okay, so who's in the area? You lot. Good amount of people. Let's take that off there. There's only three people apparently breaking out, but I reckon there'll be more. I reckon you guys can probably go to that side. I don't see any zappy thingies, but it should be fine. You can go over here, you lot. I think there was a couple of you can go up the top and the rest of you guys can go down here. Except for Lincoln. Lincoln, dude, go back to bed. Rest. I have expectations over you. Uh, This chick's still doing okay. I think she was the one where, like, if she, if she stays, I won't be mad. Okay. Should be okay. I can save... Fresh raid. Let's go. Okay. He's out here. He's out. I don't know if any of you guys got a zappy thingy, but you guys got animals. I think you could probably take McPherson on. One of you guys are incapable of violence. All right. Well, you can attack him. You can hang back with your animal because I know you're going to have one. And I think you two, you can attack him. Nina's kind of getting into position. I don't know if he's escaping or not. I might bring her back down here. If he goes out that way, he's kind of fucked anyway, I'm going to be honest. You guys got a zappy thingy. Take out black and... You're the only one with the thing, but I should be able to take him out too. Down one. Down two. Okay, didn't kill him. Okay. And take your animals round the side. I think chimpanzee can probably unlock from that. I was actually expecting you to, like, capture him, but sure. You have your rhino here. Honestly, the thrombos are going to beat him up nicely. Nina, you capture. Actually, you've got the option to take to a bed. That's definitely an option I want if I've got it. Let's see. You're still milling around. You're very close to being recruitable, though. You lot have done your job. That's great. 
How's about you capture? Oh. Quickly save that. Never trust these people not to like fuck something up. Okay. You are back to that. You could almost recruit, honestly. Oh, jeez. Who's in the hospital wing right now? Chimpanzee. I know you're tending to yourself, but kind of need an emergency one. You're in no danger. And honestly, I'm surprised that you survived that. And at times I was shocked this guy. You're at a five. You're a five. You're a three. This prison is disgusting, you guys. You're at a one. Usually I wait until it's zero or within a range of zero. But at the moment, it's so on the verge of I need them. I need them out of this prison in the best way. Why are you malnourished? Oh, that's right. I had a group just get home. It's okay. I was going to say, I'm like, they shouldn't be malnourished in any capacity. But I realized that a big group just arrived home. And with that, well, I've got people milling around up here too. Drop everything, people. This is what the drop everything mod is about. I can drop everything off everybody. And now my panthers and stuff can get up here and haul stuff. Fantastic, honestly. Okay, I need a couple of people. Mark. Mark and Nick. Look, if you guys are available, don't try to arrest. They're already captured. You're in restraints. Okay. Can you do it? No, you can't. Nick, why are you still like that? Franklin, let's see. Nope. One of you guys are going to have some prison.